Hi, today we'll be looking at some of the customizations that we can do in SQL Accounting. So for some companies like MyConsult, uh, we always have this problem of managing our yearly maintenance expiry date. Right now we have a solution for this and with a script written, we can manage all the expiry dates from just one screen. So let's say a customer wants to confirm a contract with you. All we just need to do is we come to Sales, come to Invoice, press New, select the customer ABC, select the product, say Support Plan, and all we just need to do is come to here, Info, key in the date, say one year from now, 18th of May 2021, and we just need to press Save. All this information will be then updated in your Maintain Customer screen. We just need to come to Customer, Maintain Customer, and we can look into here, ABC, 18 of May 2021. So let's say in 2021, the customer again confirms and agrees a new contract. All we just need to do is come to Sales, Invoice, press New, ABC, and then say we same product, support plan, and now the date comes to be 18 of May 2021. Save. And then come back to maintain customer and you can see the date has been updated to 2021 the good thing about this is if you make a date that is before this expiry date the system will not update for you so let's say example we make a mistake we come to sales we come to invoice and we say we press new contract kitty security and we in the date then info date, date 31st December 2019. Let's save and we we'll go back and check our maintain customer part. Kitty security will still show 18 of May 2022. So if you think that this is helpful, click the like and subscribe button to get notified when we release new how-to guides for your accounting software. Thank you.